Recce ride. What is what is your main aim and your main goal of doing this recce ride right now? Oh, well, refresh the the, the, the riders, their minds. Uh, see where the potholes, the danger points are, and if there are any really bad, like when we crossed over from the Costa Road, we turned right, left. Then what I'll do is I'll get hold of the organisers, and I, but I know they'll probably put mates, but I'll double check. Like this race was bad there. Yeah, we saw the train tracks. So when I went there, I went to the organizer and said, no, they're busy, they've organized that to get the whole ticket full, so I know that. Things like that, you know? Yeah, this road is very narrow, it's very small. We've seen just with cars coming on and off. It's dangerous. That in 14 is fucking dangerous. Yeah. Very really dangerous, yeah. So other than that, we just obviously double check. And then this is preempting that next week weather will be great. Um, that the riders will be kind of uh, the nutrition will be corrected so we, this is a refresher and also what I did was uh, the race starts at 7 so I, I told the guys be here and we start the, the recce ride at 7 so also logistically in their minds they have to leave home at the same time do you know what I'm saying? less pressure yeah you know because they've done it the week before yeah, that's why exactly. I started I like to start, if the race is starting at 6, then I would like to start the Ricky ride at 6. I mean, even though there's a bit of a chill in the air, yeah. it's not cold. No, it's not So, cold. if there's no wind, it's going to be hot. Yes. So, we'll catch about the same amount of sun, but the temperature might change. Basically, you've rehearsed what time you have to leave home the week before, really. It's a dress rehearsal. That's it, yeah. Brilliant. And then you're going to see here, why you'll see just now why it's important, because there's a section here, where you turn onto that Maripeng road, but it, it's, a, it's a funny, like, you gotta do a turn, you get down a dip, and it's a four way stop. So, you'll hear that when Mark says in the meeting, whenever there's a change, there's a possibility of, of dang, something happening. You know, so now the rise are fresh and they know. Because you'll see it's actually, and you, and you go over our hands, and you go over a stop, it's. You gotta be alert there. If we can prevent, uh, let's say, having the riders be more aware, preventing a flat, now suddenly we're in a break. You know, that something can lead to something else. And this right now, doing the recce, can lead to us not going over a pothole and still yes. having a full wheel. Yes. You know, so I think this is vital, pivotal. For more content, follow us at Team Honeycomb Pro Cycling.